Hello folks, got Ryan here with Ryan's Pest Solutions just doing an inspection here at a customer's home uh, that we got sent out to. And what we're looking at here is a gutter, okay? So this is why you want to make sure that when your gutter is put on your home that you constantly check it to make sure it is not leaking. So what happened is this gutter here started leaking up here at the top of the lip, which created moisture on this panel here. As you can see, a lot of moisture has got into there, which has caused this to rot out. You can see back here how it is pulling away here. Rotted wood like that, that just is an easier place for carpenter ants and termites to call home. So as we're walking around here at this property, I just wanted to show you a few things. Now this property here going out, they have a shed that doesn't look like it is in any better condition. There is some water that has gotten underneath here as well. So here's our lovely mulch. Which everybody knows me, I love mulch, it's great for your plants, but it is horrible for your home. Uh, it moisture logs it. So what it is actually doing here is by having this mulch here next to the house, it has rotted out this underside of this board. So now this board will have to be replaced. So moving along here, you'll see they got lots of spider webs up in this underside of this flashing in the sieve. And why would spiders want to hang out there, you might ask? Well, it's out of the elements. And the bigger contributing factor is this beautiful tree is overhanging the property, which is creating a nice moist area on this home. So we continue to look across here. And one area we always look at when we get to the air conditioner unit here, let me set my clipboard down. Is these pipes going into the house, your electrical pipes here, making sure everything is sealed up, which that looks good. Now we're looking at the pipe going into the house. Uh-oh. Looks like a problem. Let me do a little more investigating. As you can see, oh, oh, hang on. I got my all of my fingers inside that person's home. So I'm going to have to let these folks know we need to get that sealed up because that's an easy access for rodents to get into your house to stay warm. So I'll make notates of that. Also going to notate to the homeowner that we need to trim up this tree a little bit. Looks like we got a window replacement going on here. And you can see here with the window replacement, Nothing's wrong with the window. It's just the structure underneath it. And I believe the structure underneath this got sopping wet because of the contributing factor of this tree overhanging the house. So yeah. Just some helpful tips here at Ryan's Pest Solutions. Give us a call if there's anything bugging you.